And now we come to the special feature of our program, the appearance of our mystery celebrity for which my friends in the panel blindfold themselves. Are the blindfolds all in place, panel? Uh-huh. Yes, sir. Good. Will you come in, mystery challenger, and sign in, please? As you know, in the case of our mystery guest, we go to a different form of questioning. You ask one question at a time, in turn, moving clockwise. And let's begin with <laughs> Bennett, sir. Well, judging by all the laughter, may I assume that you are essentially a comic? Yes. Yes, yes. 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 Mm-hmm. Miss Francis? Um, have you appeared a great deal on television? <laughs> yes. That's yes, Mr. Andrews? Something you ate. Um, <laughs> have you appeared in Britain? Have you appeared in Britain? On stage or television? On stage or television? No. No, Miss Kilgallen? Have you ever been the star of a filmed television series? What's that? N- no. No? No. No. Mr. Sir? Are you at present appearing or are you about to appear in either a nightclub or a hotel? No. That's no, too. I haven't been flipping these. Why don't I flip a few? One, two, <laughs> three, oh. four. Ms. Trent, the yes is now. Are you a comedian who has, unlike the newer group, have you been successful for many, many years as a comic? Yes. 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 Mr. Andrews? As well as being funny and having no voice, do you sing? (laughs) (laughs) Yes. Yes. Miss Kilgallen? Yes. Um... Have have you had a hit record within the last year? (laughs) No, no. That makes it five down and five to go, Mr. Sir. Well, this will narrow it down to about 4,000 people. Have you ever written a book besides being a performer? Yes. Oh. Are you Eddie Catter? No. <laughs> Six down and four to go, Mr. Andrew. Well, I'm going to ask a question I'm not even sure of yet. You are a man. <laughs> yes, no. <laughs> Miss Kilgallen. Uh, does your wife have a lot to do with your career? You mean in a specific professional sense? Well, gets a lot of mentions, that type of thing. No. Seven down and three to go, Mr. Sir. Was this book that you published, Heaven Help Me, published by Random House? Yes. Uh, yes? Well, you Bennett knows who it is now. Well, you won't. You say it, Arlene. Is it a very, very new book written by the Mr. Television? Yes, that's right. Milton Burrow. <laughs> got it, got it. All right, all right. Amen. Actually, Bennett, it was our hope that we could get hang you up entirely, and then we were going to really rub your nose oh, in it. Boy, you hear, tell you that. And Thank a you book you much. published, and one of your authors, and you couldn't get it. He doesn't talk that way around us. <laughs> I, I tell you... I made it for Mother's Day. <laughs> Mother's Day, what? My agent. <laughs> <laughs> Everything happens on television. It's wonderful. Since you got the Emmy, that's why. It's <laughs> Milton mustn't be collecting his royalties because you have appeared in England, you know. I have been, thank you very much. <laughs> well, he may, didn't mean uh, live, I no, think. We yeah. took the question of that kind. No, no, what no, is no. the new book? No. Yes, what is it? it's, the name of the book is Earthquake, and I wrote it in collaboration with John Robert. And uh, I, I was wishing that uh, Bennett wouldn't get it, and he got it. But Mr. Cerf publishes the book, and may I tell you, thank you very much, uh, Mr. Cerf, for publishing it. And it's going very well. Besides the book uh, doing very well, I'm in town, actually, 
for the City of Hope uh, telethon, which we do uh, next Saturday night over another network for 20 hours, and I expect all of you folks to be with me. Fine. Thank you very, very much, ladies and gentlemen, and thank, thank you, you very man. much, Ben. Wonderful uh, to have you. Goodbye. Well, panel, I think you've done rather well tonight, and we will be back after this word from our alternate sponsor. <laughs>